yeah, long time no see. Uh, I think uh, we have been take some break for a while. Yeah, since this is a Chinese New Year, New Year in Hong Kong or even in China, anywhere with Chinese people. And uh, yeah, this is episode 55 Figure Talk. My name is Brian o. Yeah, please share and like this video if you like it and please help. Yeah, yeah, because we need your support to, to continue the program. You know, many people is asking, oh, uh, what is happening for this kind of you know video makers or, or bloggers or you know reviews actually yeah we're doing something you know um, everything is not free okay so we have to find support yeah if you are you if you can support us company uh, fellow collectors yeah uh, any kind of support yeah please please uh, PM me or private message me uh, we can talk, yeah. But, but but we don't know what what will what will be what will be going out. What will be what we can work something out. I don't know. But uh, anyway, we can make friends and uh, do something happy or funny. Um, this time is free old free toys. It's from mainland China brand. But uh, yeah. this is not the first time. I think we have already introduced one of the five tiger generals of Su Dynasty. You know, Free Kingdom. Uh, I Dynasty, Su, and also Wu Dynasty, the Free Kingdom. So this is the you know probably the good guys, the good guys, the Free Kingdom, the good guys. Because this is the traditional, you know they have uh, ethically or racially connected for the Han Dynasty. So this is they, they have the same family name Liu. So it's a Liu Bei. So he actually is a noble, noble nature. And um, finally, the the Free Kingdom split. Um, but the speed, but actually it split already already into many many small nations at that time, and uh, finally three big kingdoms going out, and one of one of them is Su Dynasty, and this is from the noble and traditional, you know, maybe the classic classic Han Dynasty ancestor, and um, uh, not ancestor, no, 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 I mean I mean the the. the from the Han Dynasty, sorry, yeah, I'm not getting used to with the environment because a long time I didn't do it, but maybe for two weeks already. Anyway, uh, we go to the product, yeah, please, okay. So this is uh, Liu Bei, and many people know familiar with uh, Free Kingdoms know who he is, and uh, from Feo Free Toys One Six Scale Action Figures, and uh, I think this is probably maybe number ten or number nine of their series, and uh, as as far as I know uh, the. The brand owners quite satisfied with the outcome of the quality and of the of these figures because they said that uh, the quality control and and the skill for making a uh, one six scale Chinese ancient figures is is pretty mature. So they are quite satisfied with their own products. So this one is Liu Bei, and uh, we see Wang Zhong before. Uh, I'm sorry, I, 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 I have no chance to do Guan Yu, Zhang Fei, or even Zhao Yuan from, from the Ma Chao. No, this is the second one I do for Figure Talk. Maybe maybe when they releasing uh, Guan Yu version 2 or version 3, I can do it again. Uh, this is the, you know, the cap or croc, and uh, you, know, you can see the, all the details of the costume. Yeah, they didn't ignore it. All the details of the armors, uh, wand effect, uh, the costume design, costume details, accessories, armors, uh, waist belt, Chinese style, and uh, you know the costume with some printing. Okay, the printing is real knitted print, not not seal print. It's real knitted print, but you know knitted. Okay, you can see that. Can can we can we show? It's knitted, yeah, it's jump jack. Okay, and uh, you know, many layers. So we can go to some other stuff. Actually, these figures including three different forms or three different variations. This is the original or the most uh, basic version, only the figures including. And the second version is including a white horse and a um, big low. And the third version including the white horse and also the the thread, the thread is very huge one, but you know, in my personal point of view, I I'm, I have no interest on the on the thread, you know, what to do. But it looks cool, and you know, but you know, it spares some space for storing the 
the flat. I prefer have a horse or the figures or maybe both. Yeah. Anyway, I, we, I'm just introducing the figures. And uh, people's uh, fellow collectors, if you want to know about the, the flat and the and the, and the horse, you can see Toys TV. Uh, the, the, they have already done the Toys TV versions of these figures with all the horses and with, with the flats. Uh, but in Cantonese, okay. You can see the armor details is really good. Armor details. The structuring is, you know, very details and, you know, I think maybe authentic. Uh, maybe the scale can be adjusted a little bit smaller in my point of view. Anyway, and, uh, different kind of, they use PVC plastic and uh, sometimes this, this dragon design, dragon sculpture of the belt looks really, really, you know, Chinese style. I, I think uh, only Chinese company or Hong Kong company, maybe the, the company with, you know, Chinese designers can do this. This is very Chinese style one, okay. But you can say that it looks a little bit like uh, you know a Japanese game style, video game style. But I can tell you that it's always showing on Chinese movie and TVs for so many years, more than more than thirty or forty years. So this is not this is this already existing. But uh, the the size of the shoulder armor is a little bit huge uh, compared to the old movies or classic movies and TVs of in in China or in Hong Kong. But I think uh, most people still accept this because it looks, you know, what 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 I'm suggesting is the scale look perfect and looks, you know, match, you know, uh, over scale, under scale, mismatch, makes the figures look 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 bad, right? But they 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 doing really well with that. But um, if I'm the designer or project coordinator, I would I will I will I will do something more with the armors. But I don't, I don't want to mention here, but you know, it's very personal. Uh, but they already did very good. Uh, uh, the, the armor can be a little bit smaller. But anyway, it's very good. And uh, I'll show you that this is the eight Chinese ancient style hairstyle. Look not like a cap, but uh, you know. But it's easier, it's easier for us to, what to do? To, to put this helmet on to the head. I don't try to do it here, but this is movable. And I show you the details of the helmets. They use fabrics to reconstruct the sm the the softer armors. Actually, the real armors I think is leather or with a uh, fake uh, fake style of um, fake fabric material. And they will have some you know a metal metal button on it to make it more stronger. And at the same time, they have to be elastic for the movement of the head of the general okay so it's look very good I tried I try I try I try here yeah. Yeah. yeah we need sometimes to to make it perfect okay yeah. like that okay very good yeah okay try to do something more Okay. Yeah, that's the Liu Bei. Okay, and show you the sort as well. Okay, this is very funny things. Double sort. Yeah. Uh, we we call them. You know, one is smaller, one is bigger. This is a very famous. You know, specific weapons of Liu Bei. Uh, in Chinese is Song Gu Kim. Uh, this is uh, uh, clearly mentioned in the Kingdom of Romance of the Three Kingdoms. You know the Chinese traditional Sam Gok Ji, Sam Gok Yin Yi. Okay, and uh, this is metal. Uh, the finishing can be better, but uh, anyway, it is already a very satisfied one. Can be a little bit better, but you know, we have to care about the cause. You know, the details of the of the sword grip handles is very authentic Chinese style yeah, okay. but I think the real Xiang Gu game might be look a little bit different because the, the handle is should be different but anyway 
they do a really good job because this is real workable I mean you know functional sort in one six scale in metal so they have to care a lot of factors so every they already did a very good job I put it back anyway this is Liu Bei I hope I can put it I think I can make it better for the helmet but anyway it's it's not the time is gone okay thank you for watching figure talk and please share and like the movies videos you like we have we have also uh, video platforms on YouTube Toys TV and you can also see figure talk on Toys TV YouTube platform Facebook and also Weibo this is a Weibo, uh, Weibo in China but uh, I think most of the audience from like figure talk is English speaking audience and you just go to Facebook and YouTube and thanks for watching see you bye bye and lots of program is coming thanks bye bye